We got one more off the top. It was a busy day today for off the top stuff. But as you guys know, there is a new horrible looking film uh, that is coming. I believe it's I think it's coming out of Disney Plus. It's called The Call of the Wild, a dog movie with a CGI dog. I, I just I was in watching Sonic last night and they played a trailer for that and I just had my face buried in my hand. It's just it, you're, if you're gonna do a movie like that, do it with a real dog. Do it with a real dog. I know there are some things you can't do. I get it, but do it with a real dog. It looked terrible. Now I don't know. The movie might be great. It might be great. Look terrible. However, while out promoting and it was at the uh, premiere, they or Disney Plus did a premiere uh, for the Call of the Wild. And they were talking to Harrison Ford, and apparently Harrison Ford let slip that they start shooting Indiana Jones 5 in two months. In two months. Now, there has been more Indiana Jones 5 buzzing going around the, the last number of weeks. We've been hearing a little bit more stuff coming out about it, people saying it's actually moving and happening. I am still officially in a place that I'll believe it when I see it. Like, I don't care if Harrison Ford said, I got to get up at 5 to start shooting Indiana Jones tomorrow. I'll still believe it when I see it. Because this has been dragged on for so long. This this movie was supposed to be in theaters already. So, whatever. But, I mean, this is one of the most tangible things we've heard about the development of this movie in a long time. Now, some people, understandably, are kind of of the mind right now that Harrison Ford may be a little bit too old to play this role. To me, it's all about the story. What are you having Dr. Indiana Jones doing? And, and like you could have him doing things that makes it fit perfectly well and works perfectly right and no problem. So I'm totally good with that. So I think he'd be fine. If you can have Arnold running around doing stuff at his age, if you got Sly still running around doing expendable movies at his age, why not Harrison Ford as Indiana Jones? Yeah, you you got to adjust it a little bit, but that's fine. I'd be all for it. I still don't know 100% that I believe this is happening. Rob, this is one of the most concrete things we've heard about this in a while. Is this movie actually happening? You know, John, with the entertainment landscape the way it is these days, I <laughs> believe anything can happen. Um, every day is like the surprise day on the Mickey Mouse Club. And you just <laughs> never know what's what's going on here. And I, I, I could see, yeah, I mean, this film has been in development for ages. So it, it, it wouldn't be surprising to me. I only hope, I mean, we haven't heard about Steven Spielberg's involvement. You know, he's right. in post on West Side Story, but... You know, remember when he was banging out Schindler's List and Jurassic Park in the same year? Yeah. So I, I don't, I don't, I don't put put it past him. I mean, I can't imagine he's not directing this, but I would like to see some more concrete evidence. And like you, I don't mind that you're. Look, we've got Star Trek Picard on the air. Picard, you know, in the in the in the yep. show, he's in in his nineties and he's off on a on an adventure. Why not send Indiana Jones on the same kind of adventure? I mean. It's, it's not like it isn't Harrison Ford. And I like the idea of an Indiana Jones movie set in the 60s. You know, the first uh, uh, Temple of Doom and Raiders were in the, in the, in the 30s. Um, Kingdom of the Crystal Skull and, and actually all three of them. Uh, Last Crusade was in the 30s too. Then, then Kingdom of the Crystal Skull was the 50s. And so now they would be into the 60s. And that interests me. What does Dr. Henry Jones do in the world of the Beatles, you know, and Acid Rock and Free Love and the Summer of Love and Civil Rights and the women's movement and the invention of the pill? I want to see an huh? adventure in that, <laughs> that in that milieu. That it is it is an adventure. At this. Indiana Jones and in Swinging London, maybe. Oh yeah, well, there you go. I mean, it is weird to think that he is going to be. I think ten years. No. Yeah, I think he's going to be ten years older in this next Indiana Jones movie than Sean Connery was playing Indy's dad yeah. in um, uh, Last, Last Crusade. Crusade. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it's, it's, it is kind of funny when you put it into context like that. Wouldn't it be cool if there was a, ca a James Bond cameo? Like, they don't have to call him James Bond. Oh, my but God. But just like a British secret agent. Or maybe bring Henry Cavill back to play uh, Napoleon Solo from Man From U.N.C.L.E. Or like, maybe Mike Myers from or, yeah. or Mike Myers. <laughs> I mean, The Spy Who Shagged I, Me. I, <laughs> Aaron, do you think it's it's time? For, first of all, should they even be doing another Indiana Jones? And, and if so, do you think it's actually going to happen? Because we've been hearing a lot of stuff. Harrison says they're shooting in two months. What do you think? I mean, I, I think that this is one of those franchises that brings up so many feel good warm fuzzies for people uh people enjoy people love indiana jones i love indiana jones i grew up on these movies and there and there is something also about harrison ford he is so charismatic 
no matter his age. And I do agree that, you know, seeing him in the 60s of sort of like this, uh, you know, laissez-faire, free-willing, do-as-you-do kind of attitude, I'd love to see him with, a you know, a, a protege. Um, do, do we have an Indiana Jones son Yes, Shia I, LaBeouf, but I, I really right. doubt they'll bring him back. Right, I agree, <laughs> but I'm I, I would love to see I would love to see Matt Bomer enter this world. I don't know why, but I kind of just feel like he and um, Harrison Ford would have a really exciting chemistry together. Um, it, not in a romantic way, but in a <laughs> you know, protege sort of way. Um, but yeah, I, I'm into it. I think Harrison Ford is one of those actors who has consistently um, aged like a fine wine. And while I don't expect him to be rolling under any, you know, quickly closing doors or uh, doing the 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 hot and fast action shots that we've seen in the past. I think that this will be a really fun ride, but I agree with you, John. I want to know what's the story. What are they what are the, what are we going to talk about and uh, like Rob, what what time zone are we in? What time period are we in? Yeah, no me? more please no more alien artifacts. Like like please no more alien. That's all I'm asking for. Guys, question is for you. Is it okay that they're moving? Like, are you excited about an Indiana Jones 5 at this point? And the second question is, do you think it's actually going to happen? I, I'm still in, I'll believe it when I see it kind of mode. What do you think? Jump on down into the comment section below and let us know your thoughts. Okay, guys.